Characteristics of the field. The characteristics of the field of organizational behavior, emphasizing its interdisciplinary focus and descriptive nature. Let's break down these characteristics and elaborate on them. Interdisciplinary focus. Organizational behavior draws upon concepts and ideas from various other fields, recognizing that human behavior in organizational settings is influenced by multiple factors. Here are the key disciplines that contribute to the interdisciplinary nature of organizational behavior. Psychology, organizational psychology, a subset of psychology, plays a significant role in understanding human behavior within organizations. Concepts like individual differences, motivation, and group dynamics are central to both psychology and organizational behavior. Sociology, sociologists study social systems, including organizations. Organizational behavior overlaps with sociology, especially in its focus on understanding organizations as social systems. Anthropology, anthropology provides insights into how culture influences organizational structures and the behavior of individuals within organizations. Political science, political science concepts, such as power dynamics, decision-making, and conflict resolution, are relevant to understanding behavior within organizational hierarchies. Economics, economists' interest in labor markets, productivity, human resources, and cost-benefit analysis aligns with topics of concern in organizational behavior. Engineering, industrial engineering, in particular, has a strong connection to organizational behavior through its focus on work analysis, productivity, job design, and labor relations. Medicine, the field of medicine contributes to organizational behavior by addressing issues related to stress and well-being, highlighting the importance of managing stress in organizational settings. Descriptive nature. Organizational behavior primarily aims to describe relationships between various behavioral variables rather than predict behavior in a definitive or prescriptive manner. This descriptive approach is due to several reasons. Immaturity of the field, organizational behavior is a relatively young field compared to some other disciplines, which limits its ability to make precise predictions. Complexities of human behavior. Human behavior is inherently complex and influenced by numerous factors, making it challenging to predict with certainty. Lack of valid measures. The field faces challenges in developing valid and reliable measures for many behavioral concepts, further contributing to its descriptive nature. Context-dependent relationships. Behavioral relationships observed in one organizational context may not apply universally, and their strength or nature can vary in different settings. Despite its descriptive nature, organizational behavior is valuable for several reasons. Managerial insight, it helps managers understand and navigate the complexities of human behavior in organizational settings, enabling better decision-making and management practices. Improved organizational performance, insights from organizational behavior can lead to improvements in employee satisfaction, teamwork, productivity, and overall organizational performance. Adaptation, organizational behavior research provides tools and knowledge that help organizations adapt to changing circumstances and challenges. In conclusion, Organizational behavior's interdisciplinary focus and descriptive approach are essential for understanding and managing human behavior within organizations. While it may not provide definitive predictions, its insights have practical applications that can benefit both individuals and organizations. Let's explore the comprehensive and detailed real-time examples and case studies for each of the characteristics of organizational behavior. Interdisciplinary focus. Psychology. Real-time example, employee motivation, in a multinational corporation, a team of organizational behavior specialists collaborated with psychologists to improve employee motivation. They used psychological theories of motivation to design incentive programs. Through surveys and interviews, they identified what motivates employees in different departments. As a result, they implemented tailored reward systems, 
leading to increased job satisfaction and productivity. Sociology. Case study, organizational culture, a leading tech company faced issues with employee turnover. Organizational behavior experts, in collaboration with sociologists, conducted a comprehensive study of the company's culture. By analyzing social interactions, hierarchies, and values within the organization, they pinpointed cultural factors leading to dissatisfaction. This interdisciplinary approach enabled the company to reshape its culture, reducing turnover and improving employee retention. Anthropology. Real-time example, cross-cultural management, a global consulting firm aimed to expand its operations to multiple countries. Organizational behavior researchers, along with anthropologists, conducted cultural assessments in target regions. They identified cultural nuances affecting communication, decision-making, and teamwork. By incorporating these insights, the firm successfully adapted its management practices to foster cross-cultural cooperation. Political Science Case Study Conflict Resolution a government agency faced interdepartmental conflicts hampering productivity. Organizational behavior specialists collaborated with political scientists to address the issue. They applied political science principles to understand power dynamics and decision-making processes. By implementing structured conflict resolution mechanisms influenced by political science concepts, the agency reduced conflicts and improved efficiency. Economics. Real-time example, labor market analysis, an HR department in a manufacturing company worked with economists to optimize labor utilization. Economists analyzed labor market data to forecast skill shortages and surpluses. This interdisciplinary effort allowed the company to adjust hiring strategies and training programs proactively, leading to cost savings and improved workforce management. Engineering. Case study, job redesign, a manufacturing plant aimed to enhance production efficiency. Organizational behavior experts collaborated with industrial engineers to redesign job roles and work processes. Engineers provided insights into workflow optimization, while organizational behavior specialists focused on employee satisfaction and adaptation to new tasks. The result was a streamlined production process with a happier and more productive workforce. Medicine. Real-time example, stress management, a tech startup recognized rising stress levels among its employees. Organizational behavior specialists partnered with medical professionals to address this issue. They implemented stress management programs, including mindfulness workshops and health screenings. Through this interdisciplinary approach, they improved employee well-being and reduced stress-related absenteeism. Descriptive Nature Case Study Employee Satisfaction A large retail chain wanted to understand the factors affecting employee satisfaction. Organizational behavior researchers conducted surveys and interviews to describe the relationships between various factors such as work-life balance, supervisor support, and job autonomy. The findings provided a descriptive overview of the key drivers of employee satisfaction, allowing the company to make targeted improvements. Real-time example, Team Dynamics, a software development company sought to enhance team collaboration. Organizational behavior experts observed and described team dynamics through video analysis and behavioral assessments. They provided detailed reports on communication patterns, leadership styles, and conflict resolution methods within teams. Armed with this descriptive data, the company implemented training programs to address specific team challenges. Case Study Leadership Styles A healthcare organization aimed to improve leadership effectiveness. Organizational behavior specialists conducted surveys to describe the relationships between leadership styles and employee engagement. The results provided a descriptive understanding of which leadership behaviors correlated with higher engagement levels. The organization used this information to develop leadership training programs tailored to their specific context. In summary, 
the interdisciplinary focus and descriptive nature of organizational behavior are evident in real-time examples and case studies that showcase how various fields collaborate to understand and manage human behavior within organizations. These approaches provide valuable insights that can lead to practical improvements in organizational performance and employee well-being.